Today, we're going to see who can build the best hidden house. Whoa, what's a hidden house? A house that's hidden, Wudo. We only have 10 minutes to build it. That's more than enough time. All right, then. Let's get started. Which side do you want to build on? The red or the green? Definitely not red because green is amazing. Red is so much better. So I'm going to this side, Wudo. No, it isn't. Whatever. Good luck, Bongo. Good luck, Wudo. Okay, now let's start building our hidden house. And since it is hidden, we're going to have to dig out some blocks. So let's select this block right here. Let's go all the way over here. And let's mine down a lot of blocks. After we do that, let's select this block. Then let's just set all this to air. And boom, look at this huge hole that we can use for our security house. Next, we're going to obviously replace all the dirt in here because dirt is literally the worst block of all time. We're going to replace it with diamonds. So let's select this block. And then let's go all the way down here and place this block and select it. Then let's just set that to diamond blocks. Now let's select this block. Select this one as well. And let's just set all this to air also. Now the inside of our house is all diamonds. Let's also set the whole floor to be diamonds. And now that we have the structure of this house built, let's start making the traps. We'll begin by making the entrance over here. But obviously, this isn't the real entrance. This is gonna be the fake entrance. What we're gonna do is place some blocks down here. Make sure these are all covered up. After that, we're just gonna put lava right here. Then we're gonna be using this thing called a ghost block. And if you guys don't know what this is, it basically copies all the blocks, except you can fall through them. So when Wudo comes here, he's gonna walk over here and fall straight into lava. But we obviously need to make sure that he comes here. So what we're gonna do is get some red carpet and also a sign with this red carpet we're gonna make a huge sign that basically points at the hole now that we have the arrow all we have to do is put a sign right here that says jump behind me real entrance and so Wudo's gonna look at this and think oh this is the real entrance so let me just jump and boom he's gonna fall into lava and die but since we have the fake entrance we actually need the real entrance so let's go all the way over here and let's break this block but i want to make the real entrance a little bit hard to find so what we're gonna use is this thing called a secret trap door and what this basically does is it copies the block over as you can see so Wudo's gonna think it's a normal diamond block but when i right click it it opens and so it looks like there's no real entrance at all but in reality there actually is and it's right here so let's add a floor right here so when Wudo drops he can actually be safe let's get some water real quick let's make sure to add some signs right here and let's add the water on the ground so when Wudo falls he'll be safe and he won't take any damage so for this next part i want Wudo to do some parkour to make that happen we're gonna have to select this block right here go all the way over here and select this block and let's set all this to diamonds let's also build a wall so Wudo can't escape and let's put it right here let's also make sure this part is a platform so when Wudo gets here he can move on to the next level now that we have this whole part clear let's start making our parkour but i don't want this to be any normal type of parkour see half of this parkour is going to be real with some real lava underneath but the other half is going to have some fake lava underneath and some really impossible jumps so Wudo's going to have to fall in order to complete them i'll explain what i mean while i'm building it so let's just build some easy little parkour jumps over here and if wudo fails any of these he basically dies let's also add some real lava right here but we need to make sure we add a little barrier right here because this part is gonna be fake lava so let's add the final easy jump right here and so wudo's gonna do a few easy jumps then it's gonna become totally impossible once he misses this jump he'll realize that he's in lava but since it's fake lava it doesn't kill him instead it heals him so let's just add the fake lava in the rest of this area right here i'm doing this so i can get a really good reaction out of wudo the next few traps in this house won't be as friendly though they're gonna get more and more insane as time goes on now let's just break this block right here so we can make the both lavas combine and this looks totally legit even though one side kills you and one side heals you once wudo gets to this area i want him to walk down this hallway so let's add a huge wall right here so he can't do anything else but walk through here there you go and for this next part let's make it so wudo has to jump over over some mines and to show you guys how insane these mines are let me go all the way over here when you walk over these things what basically happens is it exposes the entire area it's deadlier than creepers and tnt so let's just say if wudo even touches these things he's dead so let's go back into our secret house and start adding them we'll add a row right here then we'll add another row right here and we'll make it a little bit hard by adding one right next to the other one then we'll add like a zigzag checkerboard pattern and for this final one we'll just place some randomly and now our mine jumps are basically complete. Wudo's gonna have to complete this whole thing without touching a single mine. And like I said, if he does touch any of them, he's literally dead. So once Wudo does complete this little mine maze, I want him to come down here and fight some mobs. So let's add a huge diamond floor right here. Let's add some walls right here. And we need to make sure that Wudo doesn't take any damage getting down here. So let's add some water. Let's get some signs to make sure the water stays in place. And there you go. Now we have a safe jump. And once he does get down here, I want him to decide between two 
chest. So let's get a normal chest and let's get a trap chest. One of these chests is gonna have TNT under it and the other one is gonna have really good loot. So let's add the normal chest to the left and let's add the trap chest to the right. Let's obviously add TNT under the trap chest and let's add red wool under the real chest so it looks like it's TNT. Let's also add red carpet around this whole area so it looks like there is no TNT under this chest. Once this is done, let's go underneath right here and let's get some obsidian blocks because if you guys didn't know obsidian blocks don't blow up to tnt that's why they're really good for traps like this i obviously don't want to blow up the rest of my house so we're gonna keep the explosion in this area right here and let's add a whole bunch of tnt underneath so when wudo opens the chest he's gonna be totally blown away literally now that we have that let's add some good loot inside the real chest let's get some diamond armor because diamond is the best material in the world and let's also get a diamond sword we'll even throw in a golden apple let's just add all this stuff for the chest and now wudo has to make the right option so he's probably guaranteed to kind of die in this trap once wudo gets all his loot this is the area that i want him to fight all the mobs in so let's add another wall right here so the mobs and wudo can't escape to spawn in the mobs we're gonna need some dispensers some redstone repeaters some redstone dust some secret pressure plates and some skeleton and zombie spawn eggs so let's add all the dispensers right here and here we have eight dispensers which means eight mobs are gonna spawn at once after that let's add some redstone repeaters behind them we're gonna have to break some of this wall so we can route the redstone to them then let's connect all them with this redstone and let's make it go all the way over here we'll even add a redstone repeater right here so the connection isn't weak then let's keep dragging this along the wall and let's bring it all the way over here and once it's over here let's route all this down here and now that we have all the redstone connected what we're gonna do is use secret pressure plates now if you guys didn't know these things basically copy the diamond blocks but when you step over them they act like pressure plates so wudo won't even know what hit him now let's just add some diamond blocks to block up all this redstone i can't wait to see wudo's reaction when he has to fight like eight mobs at once it's gonna be hilarious and now that we have this all organized all we need to do is go into the dispensers and start adding in some mobs we'll add both skeletons and zombies because i want wudo to have a hard time fighting these things and there you go this should be the last one now if we go all the way over here and walk over the pressure plates boom mobs spawn in this is literally like the perfect trap wudo won't even see it coming and for this next section i want wudo to do some parkour but not just any regular parkour this is gonna be literally the hardest parkour of all time let's set the whole floor to diamonds and let's add a wall right here let's replace this floor with lava this parkour will be making wudo go down to the bottom of the house so it's gonna consist of many different types of jumps starting off with the slime block jump so wudo's gonna need to jump from this door to this slime block to land on this block right right here so if we try that real quick it should work and we'll even make it go a little bit higher so it's more of a challenge let's try this out real quick and boom it works then we'll make wudo do a really difficult ladder jump right here so he has to jump from here to all the way over here once he's here i want him to do another slime block jump jumping from here all the way to over here and if he messes up even one of these jumps he's gonna fall straight into lava after wudo jumps to this block let's make him jump onto this pillar right here we're gonna be adding some ladders to this pillar so Wudo basically has to jump here, then he has to go to the side and jump onto this block, then jump onto this ladder right here. So it'll look something like this if Wudo is good enough. And once Wudo goes to the top, I want him to jump all the way down here to this slime block. And from this slime jump, I want Wudo to jump onto this block. Then we're gonna add some iron bars to this parkour course. And if you guys didn't know, iron bars are super skinny, so you can easily fall through them if you make a mistake. Let's add another one of these types right here. So Wudo has to go from this block all the way to this block. And for this last jump we're gonna make it a really simple jump so all wudo has to do is go from here to here let's add a wall right here so wudo can't get to the other part of the house let's just make this little area a whole room so wudo's gonna have to jump from here all the way down here we'll add some water so wudo can survive the jump and once wudo's down here i want him to be really really confused and to do that we're gonna need some torches and some torch levers so let's add a bunch of torches to this room so wudo is super confused except out of all these torches there's gonna be one real one and that one is gonna be this one right here and this isn't a normal type of torch though this is a torch lever and it basically acts like a real lever so if we right click this it's gonna make the same sound and have the same function as a real lever there you go so let's just go behind this torch lever and let's start placing some redstone this redstone is basically gonna need all the way over here to where wudo is gonna be met with the secret iron door and if you guys couldn't tell what this is already it's basically the same thing as every other trap in this house it copies the the blocks but acts like a door so when 
Wudo presses this torch lever right here, this door should open. We'll even add some more torches so it's even more confusing for Wudo. And over here is gonna be the end of the house. So let's get some chests. And inside this chest, let's put some enchanted golden apples and some green wool since Wudo loves the color green. So now let's just spread this apart inside the chest itself. And boom, now we have the final prize for completing this house. But we're obviously not gonna make it that easy. What we're gonna do is add some questions for Wudo to answer. And if he answers any of them wrong, he's gonna die. So let's build a wall right here. And over here, let's add three different passageways. Let's get some signs and some paintings. Let's add the signs to the walls. And let's add a painting to each of them. And so each of these ways are gonna lead to different paths. The first of the three questions is gonna be, should the viewers subscribe? And the correct answer to this question is obviously, of course. Because everyone watching just totally subscribe. And the incorrect questions are no and maybe. Behind the incorrect answers, what we're gonna do is add some penalties. So the first one, he's literally just gonna fall into his death. And the other one, he's gonna fall into a pit of lava that he can't escape. So if he chooses the right answer, he'll live and he'll move on to the next part of this quiz. The next question is gonna be, what is the best block? The options are green wool, diamond, and dirt. We all know what the correct answer is, and that's obviously diamond. And once Wudo answers this question correctly, he's gonna get the prize. And he's gonna be done with the security house. But I don't think he can reach down here without dying a lot of times. So let's see what happens. Hey, Mongo, time is up. Oh, I know, Wudo. I'm coming over to your side right now. Oh, trust me. You're never gonna figure out how to get through my hidden house. Oh, we'll see about that, Wudo. Let's just say my one's gonna be better than yours. Okay, yeah, whatever. Just follow me and take a look, Mongo. Whoa, what is this? Why are there three different white blocks? Well, the top level security, of course. Come and read the sign, Mongo. Pick a sign? Wait, what do you mean pick a sign, Wudo? Do you mean uh, pick a block? Uh, oh, uh, yeah, yeah, actually pick a block, yeah. Uh-huh, well, which block should I pick, Wudo? You should pick for me. Well, if I had to choose, I think I'd pick this one. Well, that one is definitely eliminated because you definitely want me to die, okay? I'm not dumb, Wudo. Uh, All right, then I'm jumping into this one. Come on. Oh, no. Oh, no, I'm dead. Oh, my gosh. Uh, you should have taken my advice. I can't believe it's only been one minute. I already died to your house, Wudo. Are you serious? Well, you should have taken my advice. I told you which was the real one. No, I'm not taking this one or this one. So that must mean it's the middle one. Come on, please be right. Please be right. <gasps> yes, I was correct. Let's go. How in the world did you figure it out? Okay, you know what? Whatever. Just follow me, okay? This is the hardest lava parkour that you have ever experienced in Minecraft. Trust me. You are not getting past this thing, Mongo. It's too hard for you. Oh, really? I'm supposed to quit, and this is supposed to be hard. Are you serious right now? Watch this, Wudo. There you go. There you go. There you go. What? what? How? There you go. Here you go. And boom. I'll even do this one backwards. Ready? Boom. What? You're too good. I am kind of a pro at Minecraft, Wudo. Look at me. I'm literally a king. I have a crown on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Whatever. Just get down here. Let's go whoa, on to the next whoa, part. Stop pushing me. What is wrong with you? Okay, what's this? Read this. It's a very important question. What is the best color? Green, obviously the best color, or red, obviously the worst color. I mean, you're green and I'm red, so I'm gonna pick red. Come on. Oh, no. I died again. <laughs> red is obviously the worst color, Mongo. You're gonna have to pick green. I really don't want to pick green. You know what? This is what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna remove this banner right here. I'm gonna take this one and I'm gonna put it right there. Yep, now it's red. Let's go. It's not red. Okay, you know what? Fine. We're just gonna continue on. Go ahead and open this chest, Mongo, because you're gonna need what's inside. A wooden axe? That's it? There's nothing like diamond armor or nothing? Like, just a wooden axe? Nope, because you're gonna die to the most vicious silverfish ever discovered in Minecraft. These things are gonna kill you in like two seconds, Mongo. Oh no, this is actually super scary. Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna do this parkour jump right here. What? what? That's right, no, Wudo. I'm a pro. Wait, okay. what? You can't hit me? That's not allowed. What do you mean? You're the one that's cheating. What? Oh, no. Come on. I can kill these things. Oh, no. I'm getting low. This is not good. Can I just kill a few of them? Come on. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh, no. I'm missing. Okay. You know what? I'm getting low. I'm going to run. I'm going to run. I'm going to run. What? You can't do that. I'm out. Okay. What's down here? Let me just go down here. What's this down here, Wudo? Okay. Fine, Mongo. You know what? This is a TNT trap. You have to run past these TNTs without falling through because this goes up into the void. Okay. Let me like lightly push it and wow. Wow, you were correct. Wow, it is a giant pit. I definitely don't want to fall down there. So I'm just going to sprint. Ready? Three, two, one. Boom, 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 boom. Oh, no. Oh, no. Are you serious, bro? Oh, oh Mongo, I never said it was going to be easy. So go ahead and try again. But that's your third death, okay? Okay, well, luckily, I learned from my mistakes. So I can do this. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. <gasps> boom, boom, 
Boom, boom, boom. Let's go. Oh my gosh, I did it. Let's go. You cheated by jumping, Mongo. You're supposed to run in a straight line. Uh, no, what the heck? You never said that. Okay, whatever. Just come on over here and take your little prize. Well, what's inside? And really, Wudo, just an apple. Yeah, I'm sorry, Mongo. That's all I could afford. I can't really give you much else. Plus, it's red. I thought you loved the color red. I mean, I do love the color red, and I'll take whatever I can get, Wudo. You know what? Thank for this apple. I look really nice with it. But I know for a fact that my hidden house still looks way better than yours, so I want to go see what yours has to offer. Okay, let's do it, Wudo. Okay, Wudo, welcome to the number one hidden house in the world. Ew, what is this? Diamond? For a hidden house, this is way too obvious. You can see diamonds from so far away. Well, yeah, my house might not be as obvious as your one, but it has better security, so watch out, Wudo. Anyways, look, here's a huge arrow pointing to the real entrance, so uh, look over here. What does the sign say? Oh, it says, jump behind me, real entrance well i mean the sign's not lying so let me just hop in whoa, 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 what what the hell <laughs> that's what you get Wudo. just so you know those were fake blocks and you jump straight through them and die fake blocks how in the world do you have the technology well you know i am kind of a mastermind so uh you know i can figure stuff like that out anyways how about you try and find the real entrance since that was the fake one but th if that's a fake entrance but i don't see anything else here where can a real entrance be i'll give you a hint Wudo. let's just say it's in the edge of the build edge of the build hmm well you did use some tricky tricky tools on me like these fake diamond blocks so there must be another one somewhere. Let me see. Come on. It's got to be around here, right? Just the corner. And oh, whoa. Wait a second, Mongo. Did you put a fake trap door here with a diamond? Uh, maybe. Here, just jump down there, Wudo. You'll see the rest. I knew it, you scammer. All right, Wudo. Welcome to the most impossible parkour there is. Impossible parkour? Mongo, this looks easy. All right, well, then how about you do it if it's easy? Okay, then I will. I just got to hop onto this block, hop onto here. Yeah, whew, I'm not even breaking a sweat. Now, let's see. I got to jump onto this block, which was a little bit hard. I'll admit, I'll admit. Oh, now this one. This one might seem a little bit hard, Mongo. I don't know. I think I might have to grow some wings or something to reach all the way that far. You got this, Wudo. Come on. Oh, uh, let me just go all the way back to this end of the block. And... Oh, I'm dying. I'm dying. I'm dying. But, wait, wait a second. I'm not dying. How? Well, you're not dying because this is fake lava, Wudo. And you don't die in fake lava, okay? Oh. Oh, you used fake lava. How could you pull a trick on me like that, Mongo? That's so mean. I really thought I was going to die. Well, it's because I wanted to scare you really bad, and it kind of worked, I guess. Uh, okay. What else is down here, Mongo? Are these mines? You are correct, Rudo. How about you start walking through some of these mines? Try your best not to die. Oh, of course I'm going to die. Walking through mines is so hard. Okay. Let me just jump onto here. Oh, okay. 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 I made it onto that one. What if I jump onto this one? Oh, that was too close. I go on to here and this one. Oh my gosh, this is too scary. And here. Oh, come on, just go on to here and here. Whoa, you're actually really good, Wudo. What the heck? I did not expect this. Okay, let me just jump onto this one and this one. Good job. Now here's a little landing pad for you to jump onto. And you get to choose between two chests, Wudo. The left or the right. And let me give you a hint. Pick this one. Pick this one. But why would I pick this one? Obviously, you should be this one because you're telling me to pick that one. Not really, Wudo. I'm telling you, this is the good one. I'm not lying. There's no way, Mongo. You're lying. That chest is not safe at all. It has to be this one. What, why is there only any chest? And what's that sound? T -t 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 -t! And you just blew up, Wudo. Nice. Why in the world did you trick me like that, Mongo? That was so mean. What do you mean? I literally did not trick you at all. I was telling you which chest had the good items and you picked the other one. So it's your fault. Oh, uh, okay. You know what? I just thought you were trying to trick me, okay? I don't trust you. Well, now you should trust me because I was giving you the truth. Anyways, the other chest has some armor I want you to have. So let me quickly give that to you right now. Uh-oh. Why are you giving me armor? What is ahead in this house? Uh, maybe some really, really scary mobs. Oh, I don't like scary mobs, Mongo. I want to get out of here. Good luck, Wudo, because you're going to need a Start walking forward, buddy. Start walking forward. Okay. And whoa, these things spawned out of nowhere. Oh, come on, mobs. You guys are so dead. There's no way you're going to kill me. Hiya. I'm going to spawn in a few more. What? No, don't spawn in more. What are you doing? And maybe just a few more. Oh, no. There's so many. Why in the world would you do this to me, Mongo? This is so mean. You got this, Wudo. Come on. There's a few more skeletons. I need to pass this house. Come on. There's only two more left. Die, die, die. Okay, last one, last one, and whew. that's what you thought. I just spawned in more. No, why? I 
look like a porcupine. Skeletons, zombies, die. How are you not dead yet? Oh my gosh, I expected you to die by now, man. What the heck? Don't you dare spawn it anymore, Mongo. Do you see how many arrows are on me? This was ridiculous. <sighs> Fine, I guess you're really good at parkour. Just take this door onto the next part. <sighs> okay, what is it here? Oh man, what in the world is this? Welcome to Slime Parkour, Wudo, where you literally have to jump onto slime blocks to do some parkour. So good luck, Wudo. Oh no, I'm not good at this, Mongo. Okay, okay, you know what? Let me just try, jump onto here, and no! Let's go. That means you're about to die the third time. The score is 3-3. Three, three. If you die one more time, you lose, Wudo. Okay, okay, come on. I can't fail this jump, okay? I just gotta go here, hop onto this. Oh, okay, okay, I did this one, I did this one. What's this, a ladder jump over here? Come on, that's too easy. No! No way you died to a simple ladder jump. Wudo, look at this. I just did it right in front of you. Okay, come on. I just gotta go here, and then I'm gonna jump on that ladder. Okay. All right, now I need to just do this super, super hard jump and Woo, I did it. Good job, Wudo. You're actually pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. Now I just need to go up these ladders and... Ooh, okay. We're about to finish this up. Gotta jump onto here and... Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. How did I die again? Another death, Wudo. You're definitely losing to me. Okay, come on. I'm gonna do this jump, okay, Mongo? It's way too easy. I just gotta go here and then up here. Whoa! Oh, I did you it. weren't even supposed to go there and you did that. Nice, Wudo. Because I'm just too good at parkour, Mongo. Now I just need to make this last jump and I made it. Good job on completing the parkour. Welcome to the Room of Torches. Room of Torches? What in the world is this for? I don't know. Figure it out. I'm just gonna be standing here in the corner. Figure it out. Out. Okay, well, if you want to figure out, I guess it should start breaking everything. Come on, Mongo. Just give me a little hint, please. Okay, fine. Let's just say one of the torches is the lever, Wudo. Wh one of the torches is a lever? How? Magic trick. I won't tell you, though. You have to figure out yourself. Magic trick. Okay, okay. So let me just start right-clicking on all of these because one of them is a lever. Come on, and... Whoa. Wait a second. It was that one. That's a lever. And it opened the store. No, it wasn't. No, Mongo, do not even try and mess with me. That is a flipping lever that you hit and it opened up this door. Where does it take me? Good job on finishing that level, I guess, Wudo. Welcome to the next stage, okay? This stage is going to question you a little bit, okay? And the first question is, should the viewer subscribe? Which, 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 which one do you think I should pick, Mongo? Well, obviously, there's one correct answer, Wudo. If you don't pick it, you're going to die. And it's no. Bye. What? No, I'm dying. You were wrong, Wudo. Obviously, the viewers to subscribe, so I'll just give you the answers, of course. I know it was, of course, Mongo. I was just kidding. Everyone subscribe. What is the best block, Wudo? Is it green wool, diamond, or dirt? Obviously, green wool, but no! Nice. You died again. What is it with these ridiculous questions, Mongo? You're purposely rigging it. You know what? The viewers should subscribe to me, and actually, green is the best color. What is this? Wrong, 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 Wudo. And you've died so many times in my house that I've lost count. Clearly, this is the best hidden house. The correct answer is diamond. Oh, uh, okay. Whatever. If you want to call it diamond, sure, okay? Good job on winning, Wudo. For winning, you get a chest full of amazing items. <gasps> Wait a second. Is that lime green wool? Forget the enchanted golden apples. I just want the green wool. Good job on beating my house, Wudo. Even though you died way more times than me, that means I won. Do you know how the viewers can win? How can they win, Wudo? By subscribing. That's right. Everyone subscribe and click on the video on screen to see more. Bye!